Alexa, stop. Naughty Alexa. And I know we'll go Through the wastelands, through the highways Till my shadow turns to sun rays And I I feel like I look like that right now. Sick day. It's the next one. The end of a very, very long day. CMP International. Over and out. And then also add, also add another 20. Same What's up guys, Liam here, welcome back to LSJ TV. The footage that you guys have just seen was from the CMP International, the NFM UK show. There'll be plenty of content coming out on the media page over the next couple of weeks from that show. I was the official videographer, which is kind of a cool, uh, a cool little title, a great day, a very, very long day. We'll get into that in just a second. For now, drop this video a like, comment down below, subscribe if you are new. We've got some Halloween stuff going down today as well. It's going to be a good one. Let's get into it. Ladies and gentlemen, the CMP International. One of the longest working days of my life, and that is saying something. But what an awesome day. The standard was ridiculous. Competitors, congrats to every single one of you. And I'll hopefully join you very, very soon. The overall winners at the Atlas in Texas. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, it is on the cards. But what do I need? A passport. I need a passport. Also, you know like when, when the lights come on at a club? after a full on night out, it's like four o'clock in the morning. And the lights come on and you just go, oh, I feel like that is how I look right now. It's certainly how I feel. Uh, get, uh, uh, get me home. I actually feel a bit shit guys, genuinely. It's the first time I uh, have sat down all day, and no, I'm, I'm I'm not joking. That's the first time I've sat down all day. So my day started quarter to seven this morning. It's now quarter to twelve. Uh, quarter past eleven. Sorry, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, sixteen. Oh my god, sixteen hours. It'll be like seventeen, eighteen by the time I actually get home. I don't want to moan because I've had an awesome day and this is just such a phenomenal opportunity for, for me. But my God, have I earned my pennies today. Woo! I've actually just had to sit here for 10, 15 minutes. It's now half past. It just would not have been wise to, to drive home, to be honest. I was absolutely just on another planet. Um, so I just uploaded a quick story. There we go. And I think we're going to drive home now. I just need to collect my thoughts and, and chill out and actually have a sit down, you know. Man, what a day. What a day. I, I can't believe that this is what I'm doing now. This is... This, this is my life, this is my job, this is me, this is a business that is surpassing what I could ever imagine it to be in terms of the things that we're filming, the people that we're filming with, the companies, organisations, federations, promoters, whatever you want to put it, however you want to put it, 
the things that we're doing, it just bodes well for the future. And it makes me feel so, so good because I work hard, guys. I work really, really hard. I work all hours to try and please a lot of people, including myself, because I have my Wednesday, Sunday schedule that I insist on sticking to. People tell me to take a rest from that, but out of principle, I just don't. It's just what I do. Consistency wins. It's the way that I've always been. Consistency is the foundation of this channel. And it just makes my day to be to be filming stuff like this, to be doing stuff like this for a living. This is my job. It's my livelihood. People wonder how I'm bouncing around after 14, 15, 16 hours without putting my camera down like a Duracell bunny. Because I fucking love this shit. I fucking love it. This is my passion. This is what I love to do. I love creating stuff. You have any idea how many video ideas I've got in my head for promotions for NFM UK, for everything, for Texas coming up, everything? You have any idea how many things I've got in my head off of the back of today? Wow. Wow, wow, wow. I've got about 10 hours of, raw, of just raw footage. 10 hours. So you can only imagine how long the day has been. When I've got 10 hours of actual footage, that's just when the camera was on. I love this shit, man. I fucking love this shit. But we are just getting started. We are just getting started. You ain't seen nothing yet. You ain't seen nothing yet ladies and gentlemen things like the cmp international just the beginning thank you all so much for your support because i would not be in this position filming things like this shows like this if i wasn't doing what i was already doing and i wouldn't be doing what i was already doing if it wasn't for your guys support it's as simple as that so thank you, yes you, if you're still watching at this point in the video, for being responsible for one of the best working days of my life. One of the longest days, but one of the best. I always say that I will work harder than most. I don't say all, I don't say everyone, I say I will work harder than most. Most people would not not put the camera down for 14 hours straight would not film that volume of content not every single person that I filmed not every bit of content that I filmed I'm going to get paid for so most people will just avoid that altogether but we did it we filmed it I might not need it I might not use it I might not edit anything from it but now I have the footage forever if I play my cards right and the technology doesn't fail on me but you guys see what I mean I will work harder than most People think that it's luck that I'm in situations like this, that things just happen. Ah, oh, got really lucky. There's an old saying, what is it? Something, uh, luck is when hard work meets opportunity. I think that's it. Right time, right place, meet the right people, network, grow. Build your fucking dream life. Build your business, build your family. That's ultimately why I'm doing it, to, to have a good life for, for myself in the future, for my family in the future. I watched my old man work all hours as a kid to allow me to do what I'm doing today. That's a story for another time, but I'm very much here, sat in this car, sat in this seat, sat in this position in Leicester outside the Athena Theatre because of my old man. He knows that. I hope he knows that. What a day. What a day. I do enjoy just sitting and reflecting after a day like today. Together, we will grow. Right, let's not have the same problem as what we had last time, eh? Original ticket first, ladies and gentlemen. Phenomenal, absolutely phenomenal. Right.
Ah, uh, now which way do I go? Oh, let me take Sai. So I think Sai. Sai, did you did, did you manage to get to your car? Let me let me let me text before I leave. Whilst in park and neutral and stuff, we're gonna have to stop at some petrol service, some service station on the way, you know, because I have eaten a meal deal sandwich that luckily Sai got for me. Because well, not got for me. I think he, I think there was a bag, and he was just like, "Take this one." Because so I knows what I'm like when I don't eat on days like this. So, Sai, so thank you, mate. I really, really appreciate it because I wouldn't have had any food otherwise. I prepped myself a meal, but there was no forks. There was no way to heat it up. It's cold mints and a bag rice, like beef mints. Okie dokie. Let's go home, ladies and gentlemen. What a day! What a day! Oh my word! What an unbelievably good day! Like, I'm so tired, but what a great day. What a great day. Funny story for you all, where this, uh, where this show was today uh, was actually the scene, or nearby, basically next to, where I did my first ever media shoot. Um, it was literally just around the corner. We parked around the corner, just walked around Leicester, primarily around the Athena, or nearby. I just didn't realise at the time when I came for the um, previous competition. It's uh, it's cool. It's kind of like full circle, you know. This is one of the ways that I'm going to plan on expanding my business, and it's also where it started. It's it's kind of nice. It's really really cool. I love how life works out like that sometimes, you know. I want to ring my dad and speak to him, but it'll probably be in bed. I'm buzzing. I got no one to talk to. <laughs> you guys, you guys are my friends. I'll talk to you guys. Oh, the drive-through shut. Oh, is it shut? The lights are on. I hope it's not shut. If it's shut, I'll cry. I'll actually cry. What the hell is this on the radio, by the way? Rubbish, man. Right, BRB. <sighs> oh, let me show you guys what I got. So, we got large chips, five chicken selects, and one of the greatest things that McDonald's have ever done. That's a run of fucking dippers, mate. I'm going to chill for five because it's already been that long of a day. Ten minutes sat in eating some proper food. <laughs> proper food. Won't hurt, you know. So. Mm. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, I was just stood in there. Everyone else was like wrapped up in coats and I'm just here because I'm still hot. My t-shirt and shorts, I look like shit. It's midnight on a Sunday. People probably thought, what the hell? Like, has this kid been on a bender or something? Like, give me the chicken, man. Give me the fucking chicken. Oh, look at that. Oh, look at that, ladies and gents. Ah. Oh. Mm. And sweet curry as well. With chicken selects, is just, ah. Oh. Mm. Fuck. My phone is popping. Oh, hello, mate. You've parked very close to my car. Whoa, please don't hit it. Oh, my days. Flipping heck. The salsa dip to go with the... Oh, come on, mate. I'm too tired for this shit. Open. <laughs> I'm so tired. Oh, my God. But you know like a level of tiredness when you know when you sit down in bed. You're just not going to be able to get to sleep. Not for me right now. Oh well. Let's put the radio on, shall we? I need to find somewhere to go for a wee. The toilets were shut in there for some reason. I am busting. Oh, this has hit the spot, man. Oh, my friend is back. Please be careful next to my car. Oh my god. This is a tune, by the way. <sighs> that was a lot of food. That was a lot of food. Am I ready to go home? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Am I ready? Let's go, ladies and gentlemen. I keep saying it. What a fucking day. Buzzing, man. Great day. Like the silly can't hold her. 
So we put our hands up like the ceiling can't hold us. It is what it is. Look for a better way to get up out of it. Yeah. And in my heartbeat, and I'm eating at the beat. Like you give a little speech to a great white shot. Come shot, we raw. This is a party. We came here to live life like nobody was watching. It's cool at half past 12 on a Sunday night from No Caller ID. How weird. Hey, 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 hey. Don't forget my love. Oh my god, I thought I was just in Bieber then. I thought <laughs> <laughs> I thought we were gonna get those three songs in a row. Fuck it out. Classic JT to kick off your Monday on Capital. Absolute total respect for a late night pancake sesh. I do love it when people text in and they're like, they're cooking like full on meals at like 1 a.m. Like not toast or cereal, easy late night snack. Like I want to know if someone's making a curry right now. If you are cooking anything ambitious, please, just for my own mind, get in touch. Oh God, this just gets better than Snooze Capaldi. <laughs> I love the radio. <laughs> Even after all this time. So what about this one? Do you want to dance, baby? Bloody capital as well, not Radio 1. Outrageous behaviour, outrageous. Flip it, eh? Come on, it's half past one. Right, let's go, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, and good night. <laughs>